Hi friends, how are you going this morning, this Arvo, this evening, whenever you're watching this? I decided today I'm going to spend the entire day doing TikTok art slash clothes making videos. So I am currently addicted to TikTok, I can admit that. And because I'm addicted to TikTok, I've seen a lot of um, DIYs, do-it-yourselves, uh, including the clothes. Now some of you are going to say, Aisha, those clothes are too young for you. But my inner teen grungy self wants to do them because I think they look cool, so I'm going to do them. So anyway, I have my paint with me, I have my palette, I have some elastic bands, I have some bleach which is in the bathroom. Essentially what I'm going to do is I'm going to dye this shirt that I'm currently wearing. This is an old black shirt, Tupac and Biggie represent. I'm going to dye this because if I muck it up I won't feel so sad about it losing it. Okay. The second thing I have is this lovely crisp white jumper oversized hoodie. I kind of want to paint on this. I'm not quite sure yet. Come along for the journey. Let's see how I go. Uh, I have a old pair of jeans, which I also, I'm thinking I'm going to paint the pockets and see how that goes. We'll see. Because there's been a lot of painting on clothes, pants, jeans. And another thing that I'm going to paint is uh, my painting overalls. I've already started something, but you're going to see this process as well. So, yeah, fingers crossed this all turns out alright. Another thing I want to do in between my videos is make that whipped coffee. Uh, it looks like a lot of sugar a lot of instant coffee and a lot of whipping. So we'll see how that goes because I know I'm going to need a pick me up halfway through this because it's gonna take time. But um, I've got my paint brushes, I have my textile medium, so I'll mix this in with my acrylic paint so that I can paint on my clothes. What else? I think that's it for now. So thanks for coming. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss a video with me.
make our pick me up now and this is the TikTok whipped coffee that is going viral I am so late to the game it's not funny people have probably already moved way past this but now I don't have measuring cups so measuring spoons but what I do have is is a spoon so apparently you need two tablespoons of instant coffee I have a vanilla flavored one because I hate the taste of instant coffee so why not make it even more gross and get a flavored one so two cups of that face you guys down to my bougie kitchen bench okay one two and then you've got to do two tablespoons of boiling water. Something else I don't have is a kettle. Who knows? I'm a weirdo. Yes, this is a pot of boiling water. This is how I boil my water. I'm very old school. Okay. One, two. I feel like I need maybe one more because this isn't quite a tablespoon. It's maybe like half. <sighs> Now you're supposed to do whiskies. Um, I'm going to try and put it into my blender. Is it odd that I feel the failure already happening when it hasn't happened yet? It's bad. Okay. Lid on my Nutribullet. Okay, let's turn this bad boy on. So that was a big fat fail. It's, I think the cup was too big and the blender thing wasn't quite getting to the coffee and the water. And the, so now I'm gonna do this by hand. And I also realized I don't even have a whisk. This, this is going to be so long. The update is we have some runny whipped coffee. So, I'll see you when I return. Hopefully my arm is still attached. Okay, my friends, here is the finished product. <laughs> now it's meant to be a lot thicker, but my arm is so sore. Okay. Ooh, yeah, so aesthetically pleasing. <sighs> it's pretty good. It kind of... Tastes like caramel, um, like a caramel sweet iced coffee, almost like a chill. You know those, um, yeah, iced coffees you buy in a box. Really sweet. But at the end of the day, okay, that's a bit too sweet. <laughs> it's good. Would I make one again? No. The main thing is it's done. Does mine look as good as every other TikTok out there? No, doesn't matter. I tried it, we did it. Even though we didn't have all the resources. So uh, take that one, TikTok. Babe, I need you to try my whipped coffee and give me your, your honest opinion on what you think of it. How'd you whip it, by hand or? I had to, I didn't have, we don't have a whip. <laughs> it took so long. Pretty good. Is it? Do you like it? Yeah. Do you want half of it? Because I can't drink all that. I love the whole thing. <laughs> Don't tell everyone what you're doing out here. Just building the drawers for the back of the camping rig. So this is for when we can finally, when the borders open everyone yeah. and we can travel. So stay tuned. Hopefully be filming, traveling, painting on the road, in the Kimberley. Okay, bye. We'll see you, bye.
are complete. I should really see what the time is. Anyway, it's the end of the day. I started at the beginning of the day. This is my tie-dye tea. Uh, looking back, I think I would have liked to have put more bleach on it. Do I like the outcome? Yeah, I do. This one here is the jumper. I went for a bit of a galaxy theme, I guess you could say. A bit of spray paint, a bit of fabric paint, some blue, some pink, some orange. And then we have my painting overalls with this little kind of freaky fish guy chomping up towards my head. So, oh, and number four, just when you thought we were done, I painted, oh gosh, a bit hard, a little flower power. It's weird, but. I painted a little flower power booty pocket. Browns, pinks, yellows. I'm going to make a TikTok now, believe it or not, and try and incorporate all these pieces. So wish me luck. See ya.